Now, last year, the government unveiled an ambitious plan to increase power production by 5,000 megawatts by 2017. However, this plan attracted criticism with the question of absorption and last mile connectivity to homes coming up and whether the country had the capacity to absorb this extra power or just have idle power. But now the Ministry of Energy has rolled out a one-month power demand study to establish energy requirements over time and use this information to plan for energy production and distribution distribution early. The ministry will ask consumers to fill a three-page online document detailing how much energy will be needed by various consumers around the country, which the ministry will use to map out energy trends and match with the supply to demand. The ministry is also rolling out a plan to utilize idle capacity at night by selling the power at a discounted rate to the county government of Nairobi for lighting as well as power up manufacturing plans. The move comes as the government ties up plans to make the country a 24-hour economy. You can send uh, the right signal so that you're not holding unused inventory and that you're not frustrating us as well by not meeting uh, the demands of, uh, of, 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 of users. To the extent that the base load today is matched to the demand, as we generate more power, that situation could happen where we are generating too much and there is no demand. And then therefore, we need to be careful going forward uh, with our 5,000, our 17,000 megawatts for the Vision 2030 and be able to ensure that we, we generate and dispatch what the economy needs.